Welcome to our very short video on how to use negative search terms in Outlook. So uh, what that means is if you are searching for something and you have a whole pile of results, you might want to get rid of some of them. I'm going to give you an example of that right now. So this is my sent items and I'm going to widen this out. Now, um, now if you look here, I've sorted this by whether uh, by the attachments. So here we go. Uh, let's go through that. Scroll to the top, there we go. So I have a whole pile of stuff with attachments. And uh, a lot of them are my junk mail reports to Microsoft. So I want to look through here, but I do not wish to include uh, things that have abuse. So what you do is you go into your search at the top and you type in the word not, and you have to use capital letters, that's the big thing. Uh, not abuse in this case will be the, uh, the word I'm trying to avoid. And you can see that gets me down to a nice, reasonable amount of uh, data to, to sort through and um, yeah and I can see there's also phishing here so I go up the bar and I can put in another search word I want a negative search on so I'm going to type in not fish I'm going to scroll through here and look there's nothing here in this address section here that has the word fish so I'm going to remove that to show you because I don't think I did that properly there we go you can see here this particular message relates to phishing and it was something that again were reported through to Microsoft and yeah so uh, I don't want to see those so not fish let me just show you that again so negative search terms are really great now there are a whole lot of other search terms you can use uh, equal to greater than uh, things like that we'll write that up on our site urtech.ca um, and um, yeah if you have any questions please get a hold of us at www.urtech.ca thanks and have a great day bye-bye